Wow. Xbox and Xbox players have let down Redfall. It's sad. This is what happens when you go to Xbox and you don't deliver. Let's get into the video. What is up, guys? It's your boy Hercules, and we are back at it again. So, Redfall had a big update, and this update fixed some issues, but it still is a broken game. Now, you're gonna have some people out there saying that, oh my god, a lot of people play this game. Nobody's playing this game. The, I believe last time it couldn't even get anybody to play or it crashed or something uh, or it, there was like only four players like actually only four people playing the game the game's dead and they still I believe they still haven't even released the 60 frames per second which is hilarious uh, they they said there was gonna be some downloadable content I doubt that's ever gonna be but supposedly Xbox saying that they're gonna fix it and it's gonna be there on Game Pass forever so future people can play Redfall. But I think, to be honest, I don't think people are ever gonna play Redfall. But hey, maybe I'm wrong. Maybe I'm wrong. Maybe 30 years from now, some kids are gonna find Redfall. They're gonna be like, oh my God, look at Game Pass. They got Redfall. And they're gonna play Redfall. Maybe they'll enjoy it. Or maybe it'll still be another broken game. But it's just, it's sad that uh, Redfall technically got an update, but it didn't fix the whole game. And no Xbox players are even playing it. And it's it's just sad. It's sad how they, uh, they treated this game. And remember, Microsoft, Xbox thought this game was going to be up there. They thought it was going to be somewhere around in the 80s. They thought this game had potential of uh, maybe not game of the year, but potentially being a big hit for them. And it didn't turn out. And another game that also supposedly is selling good, which I, I'll be very surprised if it's actually true, but let's just take the word of these so-called journalists is Starfield, but we've seen the people, we've seen the cherry picking reviews, but hey, it's okay, you know what? Um, if uh, if they get a win with, with uh, Starfield, that's good for Xbox, because you know what? They need some W's in their books, because uh, they've been getting nothing but L's, and, uh, and even those W's that they get, don't amount to nothing to be honest um i think the only good game they they have and we still don't even know when it comes out is hellblade 2 and again nobody knows when it's coming out but uh yeah i'm gonna just leave it at there it's sad to see redfall at this state but at the same time this is what happens when you release broken games that are boring and there's nothing to do there now, if you want to jump in the comments and say, well, Spider-Man's broken too. Yes, Spider-Man, my copy that I got was a broken buggy game. But guess what? The story was beautiful. To me, the story is a masterpiece. The gameplay is fun. The world building is incredible. So that I'll take Spider-Man that gives me all the good stuff with all the bad stuff and the bugs instead of uh, Redfall, which is buggy, boring, and nothing to do there. Let me know what you guys think down below. If you guys enjoyed this video, make sure to leave a like, make sure to subscribe, and I'll catch you guys next time.